And here's Bree Pettis. You may recognize him from Weekly Projects, Weekend Projects, Make Zine, and, well, the, the whole bridge building contest. That was his idea. Here you go. Thank you. All right, so I just put a bunch of slides together. I'm not sure actually what's going to happen. All right, so this is how I got started, and I made a, a, a workbench for my first podcast because I'm like, I need a workbench. And um, people are like, I can't believe it. This totally sucks. It's not right. I mean, you, the thing on Google is right, but this isn't right. Like, I made the thing that was on Google, so it was kind of funny. So then I did like a rodent powered nightlight. And so these are all comments. I put all, these are all like my projects and comments that people left. And uh, I, I, this is, I actually bought animals for my podcast and uh, one of them died and the other one spent like 12 days stuck to the top trying to get out so I finally set it free. This is a wallet. Um, somebody left a comment saying they made one. This, uh, I actually need a new wallet because this one wore out. It's like, it needs, it's a... Uh, yeah. Uh, the folks from Canon actually sent me this as a comment. <laughs> I, <laughs> um, yeah, so, <laughs> and they're like, I know, they're, it's so funny, they're like, there's a little bit of tape on there, I, you need a new battery cover, I'll send you one, <laughs> but don't let it fall in. So, um, then I made, I got, I'm into geometry, so I did all this picnic geometry stuff you can do with picnic things. Uh, <laughs> So I'm really in alternative photography, like old school. I spent a few years doing like pinhole photography and cyanotypes, and um, I have this kind of slight obsession for plastic courses. I've got a lot of them. Uh, this is the most obscure word, geek term. How, who knows what this word means? But so, not the road. Okay, so yeah, you all win. You are official. We are officially at a geek event because more than me knows it. That's Zizzy is actually a secret password when you get tangled in a maze of an adventure. Adventure. So this is my bat batometer. It's a bat sensing wristwatch, <laughs> and um, it works. <laughs> so one of the things that happened is I made this job out with a bunch of friends because uh, I, I was like, I want a robot that will take your picture and draw it. And um, I got a group of friends, and they all helped me make it, and it worked great. And uh, I wish we'd actually, we were originally going to make the software open source, but we're like, oh, we want to tidy it up and stuff. And then um, somebody's computer uh, like died and we lost everything and so now we're rebuilding it. Okay, high speed is fun. Um, uh, so I, I, I used to make, be a puppeteer, make shadow puppets, and so this is um, me making shadow puppets. But, uh, yeah. <laughs> So, um, oh, oh, using my layer helo, helium balloon next time. So this is, I actually got, I couldn't post one of these comments because I had way too many swear words in it. I mean, like a few I thought would be okay, but, um, so this is just uh, a bunch of things I did with balloons. I made this dirigible and it actually exploded and I'm on camera and I'm doing this like, <laughs> like, yeah, bad waving. So this is, um, there was this whole nerd fight about how to say solder. <laughs> I guess in the UK, you say solder. But here you say solder, and this really upset people. Because they were like, solder, that's like... And then like people did Google searches and comparison and graphs. It was bad. So, um, so uh, I did this thing with uh, Rib Goldberg contraptions with sticks and stones. And uh, yeah. And so then like all these things, one gets pulled off and it pulls off the next one and stuff. So there's another nerd fight between ABS and PVC, which is really interesting actually if you get into the molecular level of it, of like, like ABS is, is like, it'll balloon in case of, in your, yeah. Um, <laughs> Another solder thing. This is actually muscle wire, which is a really cool thing. This type of night and all, and when you heat it up, it actually shrinks 4%. So you can use it as a, a muscle. Um, so 
I finally got uh, Adobe Acrobat and made one, and I didn't press the one that optimizes it, right? So it turns out you have to like optimize the size, because then this that became like 666 k, k instead of that much. Um, <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, um, this was a really fun project. <laughs> the, the thing that's not up here is, well, um, it's embarrassing, but it involved 250 feet of, yeah, okay, thank you very much.